first time driving with a learner's permit. Yep. Hello everybody, what is going on? I am Joey. So today, yes, I am finally driving a car. Um, I'm here with my mom in the car. Uh, you may recognize her from the, I would say famous, but uh, a lot of people liked her video in the Aston Martin Vantage. Uh, that was one of my favorite videos to film and do. The uh, my mom is cooler than your mom video. Yes. Anyways, we are here today uh, because I just passed my driver's permit test, which means I can now legally sort of drive on the streets. Um, not full time, obviously. Don't have a full license yet. Gotta wait six months for that. But the point is, I am now driving. Anyways, uh, we are driving now. I uh, just thought I would take you all for a spin on my very first drive. Yes, we are recording my first drive, so hopefully I don't crash or hit anything or kill anyone or any of that. Um, so far it's smooth. We are using a Mercedes-Benz GLC 350E EQ plus power. I don't know the full name. Basically it's a Mercedes GLC hybrid. It's my mom's daily driver. And so we are just driving right now in this gated complex. And so Let's see how this goes. I have to say, this car is pretty easy to drive. I mean, that's expected. Things I don't like, uh, the steering has no weight at all. Uh, so you That's can't... because it's a daily driver and not a sports car. Does it, it, okay, for those who don't know, this car has electric power steering, which means there's no actual steering column. Um, and so therefore, it's all kind of artificially done. You can barely feel the road. Uh, I'm gonna go over a bump. Yep, didn't feel the road there. Um, so yeah, the steering takes a bit of getting used to. Uh, also being a hybrid, it's a bit weird in acceleration because there's really three steps in this car, obviously. You have electric motor, which goes first, and then from there, you then have your regular four-cylinder, and then since it's turbocharged, then the turbo kicks in. So when you accelerate, there's kind of three steps to it. Um, it takes a bit of getting used to, but luckily Mercedes did a good job on that. So yeah, as a learner's car, not necessarily the best, but it's not difficult. It's not the worst. It's definitely not the worst. Uh, it's not a Ferrari F40. I don't think that would be a learner's car. I mean, you could learn on it. Uh, Thomas from Alpha Lux, if you're watching, uh, maybe you'll let me drive your F40. I don't know. No, probably don't. Not as a learner. D don't. Uh, that'd be a bad idea. Maybe a closed skin pad situation, potentially, but. Yeah, don't do that. Anyways, we are now driving. Uh, don't really know where to. We're just kind of wandering about. Uh, I just thought it'd be exciting because I've driven go-karts. I've raced golf carts. Yes, golf carts. That is correct. Uh, and now I'm doing a car. And can't forget the motorcycles last weekend. I did do a motorcycle last weekend, so I can check myself off as doing pretty much all the vehicles haven't done a boat or an airplane yet but we'll get yeah, there you're only 15. oh actually an airplane license you could be younger for uh same with the boating license but we'll get there so not bad in getting to the dmv only two days past the first day you are eligible to get a permit for those who don't know on the day of uh we weren't available and then i was supposed to do it yesterday but thanks to a copper pipe uh, exploding in our house we could not come so that's why we were two days late but but compared to friends who had appointments in March and they got canceled we were ahead and at least I'm doing it there are people who are old enough to get full licenses who still don't have licenses or even permits point is I went as early as possible of course uh, I guess it's probably what you would expect of me and that's what I did. Uh, yes, absolutely. Bumps. So, do you find it annoying when I go over a bump, but it's only one wheel on the bump, one wheel off? Um, I don't know. Do two wheels on the next bump, and I'll see. If straddling is it more annoying than I personally going prefer going two wheels straight on it. Straight on it. Okay. One you're supposed to, but it's just annoying. Since I'm not a BMW driver, I will be using my turn signal. Let's turn on it. I hope it's his house. It's his house. weird if we pulled into a stranger's house. It's his house. Ah, 
right. All right. We've arrived. We're gonna back out soon anyway, so. We haven't really arrived if you think about it that way. Yeah, that is my first driving experience properly, besides not in a parking lot. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, short one, but you know, it's interesting to share, obviously. Most people don't really record the first time driving, but I think it's more than interesting. It's just exciting. Yeah, that's true. Uh, definitely for me. I don't know for your viewers, but I, I think you guys would like it. Uh, obviously, we'll soon have more driving content, but as time permits right now, we can't really. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more content to come. And as always, I'm Joey, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.